Love to start with a quick check-in for the collective. Wow. The Moon High Priestess. Okay, so this feels a little different. Moon High Priestess. Someone could feel very, um... Almost like... Like you're very mysterious, for sure. Some very subconscious energy, something like that. You're very wise and intuitive. Maybe someone feels... Yeah, like you're very mysterious. Okay, there's an Empress Reverse involved. Empress Reverse. Feminine energy that is not operating out of their higher potential. Um, someone is stuck with this person? Or this person tried to keep someone stuck? Or someone is seeing this, this person in a new perspective? Or this Empress Reverse is seeing you in a new perspective? There could have been something that happened during a moon cycle as well. There could be a, a group of people involved, or something you're building. There's a King of Pentacles and a group of people. There's business or... Maybe a message or something's happening very quickly here. Someone finds you mysterious or something's hidden. Someone feels like they can't see everything. They're not seeing something. Something is hidden. Something is in the dark. Something is... They're not seeing something right. Um, there could be a lot of emotions involved. Empress in the upright. I feel like this is you. And now we have a High Priestess Reverse under the deck. So it's the exact opposite of what we started with. So you have either someone making a comparison to you and this High Priestess Reverse. This is someone that could be very witchy. Someone might feel like they put all their time and energy into, into um, aligning themselves with this person. Um, you're the Empress energy. You embody all queens of the deck. Very grounded, loving, unconditionally loving, nurturing. People tend to do well around you. Smart. You've been through a lot. Um... You're overcoming some type of disappointment um, or loss. You're letting something go deep down or someone knows they're being let go of. Um, deep down someone could feel shame as well. Three of Swords Reverse, there's definitely something here about you overcoming some type of heartache. Um, the Moon Reverse, something's gonna be revealed. Someone could feel like there's some type of mania that they have to deal with as well. Two of Cups, wow. Some type of soulmate or partnership connection in the near future that is significant. You seem to be looking at the Two of Cups. Uh, maybe you know something about this already. Um, I feel like you do. The lens that someone's looking through, Ten of Swords Reverse, is all about you recovering from being betrayed, some type of sadness or loss, um, and heartache. You've over, you're overcome. You've overcome something. Maybe a betrayal. Um, something seems mysterious about that, maybe. On the outside, though, you, you come across like a um, Queen of Swords. It's like someone knows you're this loving person, 
with so much to offer, but to someone else here, you're kind of cold or you're very cold or you have very strong boundaries. You're also a queen of pentacles. Someone is seeing all these positive attributes about you. And there's like a group of people, maybe there was some sort of social dynamic that was very catty here. Or there was a, you know, someone got you in a situation with too many people. Someone got you in a third party situation. There was unfinished business. Someone could have done something hasty here. Three of Cups reverse. Too many people involved. But you have strong boundaries and you're focused on business, your home. You're very grounded. You have something of value. You're very intelligent. You're graceful, perceptive, smart. That's how someone sees you. Hopes and fears. Nine of Wands. This is some type of a relationship. This is someone's attracted to you. Someone here could be trying to cause confusion. Um, someone who's real obstinate. They're trying to cause some type of a stalemate. They see everything working out in your favor. I think it's this High Priestess Reverse. Outcome, Seven of Swords. Lying, cheating, stealing. Justice Reverse under the deck. King of Wands Reverse. There's a group of people here. Someone's playing games. Trying to do something unfair to an Empress energy. They know you've overcome this heartache. They keep getting signs, they can see it. Some sort of betrayal is over. You're moving forward, you're in the upright. You have strong boundaries. Um, deep down someone feels shameful about something they're doing. But there's a Two of Cups in the near future, maybe. They're afraid of someone passionately coming towards you. They're afraid of someone's attraction to you. There's some sort of lie going on. Someone's trying to hide something. It seems unusual. It's ending with a Seven of Swords, so let's definitely figure this out. Okay, so why is this Empress... It has to do with someone marrying you? Child, maybe pregnancy? Or are you having a new beginning? Okay, this I think is, there's another masculine energy here. They're in bad health in this family room. Well, there's a problem, a child is in bad health in a family room. They weren't expecting this. There's something about a masculine energy here with a lot to offer. Uh, a message. We saw the King of Pentacles earlier. And a Three of Pentacles. So there's something about a, a masculine energy that's a leader. <clears throat> probably a business leader. Or someone who's very good with money. Uh, so you've got this High Priestess Reverse, you've got this other King of Wands Reverse. I mean, this Queen of Swords could be somebody else, like a professional, a doctor, an attorney, a detective. some type of high level 
you know, executive um, that could be doing something on your behalf. You're very clearly um, overcoming something here, and it seems like this masculine energy is coming up out of nowhere. Um, journey reverse. Maybe they feel stopped or stuck or they want to stop you or they're blaming you. They're in bad health. They're in bad health and this false person is exposed. They're projecting at you. It has to do with something coming your way, all this money, something connected to your occupation and a message, something about you receiving a message, lovers. It's, there's a relationship here. There's a message. There's money. There's some positivity around your profession. They feel stu stopped or stuck. You've overcome something that they did. And it's like they haven't been showing up in the energy for a while. Uh, this could be a family member. This could be a colleague. This could be a friend. This could be someone connected to an ex of yours. They put a lot of effort into something and it didn't work for this sudden wealth. So I think you have someone here that's real bitter and angry, <clears throat> projecting at you. You overcame some sort of heartache and they didn't get some kind of money or payout. Um, official person. Someone is seeing you as someone who overcame heartache. There's some sort of a message connected to this. Yeah. Some, something about someone coming towards you. A courtship. A message about a courtship. And the Two of Cups is coming in the near future. Your pathway is clear. Something is cleared. You overcame something that this person did. They did something unjust. This person could feel like your life working out positively, you overcoming some sort of injustice is unfair to them, which is a strange way to think. Um, they feel like they got exposed and they feel like it's unfair. Yeah, they, there's some sort of a feminine energy here that they align themselves with that is exposed. They've lost everyone's ex, uh, respect and they feel like it's unfair. They've done something unjust and they feel like it's unfair that you're moving forward after they put all this work in. <sighs> wow. Ten of Wands reverse in the subconscious. There's some sort of guilt or shame, or they should just let something go. They need to let something go. Something to do with a child. There could be a sick child here. Somebody could have connected with this karmic feminine energy, and there's a child that came of it. Some sort of an affair, potentially. Um... And it created some sort of loss of fortune. They didn't get a fortune from this. But also this could have to do with you connecting with someone. They feel like your pathway is clear because you're connecting with someone. And this privileged lady in reverse was not expecting this. Three of swords reverse in the recent past you have overcome some type of heartache or well, this is someone deeply deeply hurt okay in regards to a masculine energy maybe from your past people are in despair about this about someone courting you they're in bad health and in despair this main male is involved so there's this mature man and there's this main male Something is a gift or a blessing. There could be a masculine energy from your past that's in despair that you're 
being courted. Something seems really unfair. You're being seen as someone who overcame some sort of great sorrow. Uh, and they put so much work into whatever this betrayal, this Ten of Swords, this backstabbing, and they feel like they didn't get the payout from it. Moon Reverse, something is going to become unveiled, or someone, there's some sort of deliri delirium here, um, lunacy that someone's expecting, because they just can't take it, someone can't take it. Moon Reverse. Despair. Someone could be in despair because some an illusion is broken. It has to do with what type of a person you are. They all know it. All these people know it. And it's like you un you demasked this karmic feminine energy who was trying to block change. You demasked them. So someone's in despair about an illusion being broken. They put a lot of work into it. And there's someone coming towards you. You deserve all of this. It's weird. It's like they... This person's perspective is so weird. It's like they... Can't see you as human. It's weird. They... If something works out for you, they feel like it's unfair. And it's like they, they've done something to set you up. And because the setup failed, it's almost like they're angry at you because they should have something instead of you. And that's what they feel is unfair. Um. And now there's some, someone's going to get exposed or something like that. Two of Cups. There's a Two of Cups coming. So you know about this. I feel that you're looking at it already. Um, house Reverse. Message of Concern. Someone could be... Something could be con happening outside of a house. Someone could be leaving a house. It's, this false person is exposed for trying to do something to you. And there's a message here and someone's leaving at the house. There's this main male involved again. I don't know if they're the ones that are messaging you or they're sending messages. This is, it's something going on between a few people. There could be legalities or... Some, someone is exposed here, this false person. Yeah, a lot of people know about this. Ten of Swords Reverse. You've overcome some type of a betrayal and you have this gift. The gift is in your hands. And this main male is here again. I don't trust this person. This is someone from the past. This person gives me bad vibes. They're in bad health over this wealthy man. Wealthy men can be someone with a lot of resources. They could be someone who's rich in spirit. They could be someone who you manifest with. Um, Queen of Swords in the environment. Courtship. There's someone coming towards you, or sudden wealth. Someone's coming towards you to court you, and they're, it's, it's a blessing. There's some type of a blessing connected to this. Yeah, your pathway is clear. That's in the environment. It's like people are seeing this and thinking about it. But you are... You have very strong boundaries, though. So it's like you have strong boundaries with whoever these people are that were doing something nefarious. There could be 
be someone else here, though, too, with this Queen of Swords and this courtship. I feel like they're operating on your behalf if they are someone else. There's something about someone coming towards you. Um, it could be business. Two of Cups could be love. It could be business. I feel like it's a soulmate connection. It's a perfect match. Um, like a contract. Marriage. Proposal. Something's coming towards you. Something's about to be unveiled. And because of it, these people's journey is over. They're stopped or blocked. It's like they blame you. They blame you. Knight of Wands. They're afraid of someone moving passionately. Um... what they keep thinking about is someone moving passionately, this wealthy man. Someone moving passionately towards you. They feel like something's slipping through their fingers. You connecting with this person. There's some sort of love relationship here with a masculine energy that's this upstanding leader and they're worried about this person coming passionately towards you seven of swords somebody is keeping some i mean sometimes seven of swords can be uh positive someone has to keep something secret that's positive in order to protect it i feel like the seven of swords could come out you know having to be stealth, um, or this could be someone doing something here they shouldn't. So let's find out. Seven of Swords. Distant Horizons. This could be energetically. This could be, this could have something to do with something happening online. This could have something to do with the past or the future. This could have to do with dreams, energy. Under the deck, expectation reverse, coffin reverse. They were not expecting something for this to, to, for something not to be over. Justice reverse. They feel like something's not fair. They put a lot of effort into something. They weren't expecting for something not to be over for you. I feel like these, these people with this masculine energy, I don't know who they are. They're, they're not someone that you were in a relationship with. But I feel like they collaborated with someone and they put a lot of effort in. They thought they were going to get something. It was like, you know, to steal something from you, to block you, to get you out of the way. There was some sort of luxurious lifestyle that this person was after. And they didn't feel like you would... be able to get any type of, that you would react, that you would defend yourself. Or this person, they, they feel like they can't make a move. They might be losing some sort of social dynamic or because they're unveiled, because people know what they've done, they can't make the same moves. They can't pretend. Because they've aligned themselves with this privileged lady reverse. Now they're exposed. They put all this effort in. Um, they, they maybe want something from this wealthy man. And for that, they need to create an illusion. Or they were trying to create an illusion so they could get something from this wealthy man. Um, they were trying to fit in. Or saying you don't fit in. Whoever this is, is very much in their ego, and they wanted you to be isolated. This was for some sort of position of control. They were criticizing you. But now, they, they, it, whatever's happening here is exactly the opposite of what they, they, they put a lot of effort. I guess this was to get ahead, to get on top. They were putting down an empress somehow. They, they thought that you were, you know, discarding you. They were going to gain somehow. 
egotism reversed. This is some type of like an ego death. There's something here that's embarrassing. You being in the upright here. There could be a whole group of people that they sold some sort of dream to. Um, they didn't want people to be... To feel like you had this cornucopia. Um, something happened. Your presence, you overcoming something here, exposed this person and this privileged lady reverse. They were lying. They were lying about something. They were lying about your originality, about you being unique. Or they themselves are not very original, but this is how they wanted to get into a power position. Was somehow working against you to discard you. Um, there could have been some sort of negotiations going on here. Um... You endured something, though. They were trying to block your fortune, but you endured. You escaped a situation. Um, and you're not taking a loss. And it's almost merit-making because... If they had just left you alone, people wouldn't see you as someone that... got through something so horrific. Um, you've overcome some loss caused by these people um yeah because the secrets are out in the recent past three of swords reverse mature man there's something about a masculine from your past that maybe you were in a relationship with it doesn't have to be um overcoming Someone wasn't cautious, maybe around this person. They were trying to sell this person a dream. Yeah, definitely. Trying to get someone into party mode or something like that. Um, maybe trying to use flirtation. Um, they didn't want this person to have any empathy or to pick up on something in regards to you. Harmony, some sort of messages. This person could be very restless the more you overcome some type of heartache. Trying to criticize you more of the same. Like you don't have any corn a cornucopia. Um, someone shouldn't be generous with you. Um, this, this has to do with romance. So I think this person has been, this masculine energy, this king of wands reverse has been doing everything they can to turn this person against you. Um, but they're, whatever they did last, that's what demasked them, them and this karmic feminine. They weren't listening to their intuition. There's something about an affair. These two could have been having an affair. Um, they could have been trying to create some type of an illusion. Um, or an illusion about an affair. There's definitely something about a couple, someone not flirting with someone, someone not going for someone in a passionate way, losing friends because of a romance. Because of romance, because of two people that are together. This could be a new Two of Cups for you, or there's some type of um, cheating going on. Um, moon Reverse Despair. They're in despair because something is being unveiled, an illusion. Um, also, they could feel very unstable, not knowing how they're going to deal with the future because they're exposed. reverse it had to do with someone not helping you not being giving saying you don't belong maybe saying you're weird um, the manipulation is not working um, there's something about an affair 
someone rebelling because of love or an affair or someone wants to be with you. And there's some sort of harmony here someone is after. Um, they don't care about superficial things. They don't care about it. In the near future, med message of concern, house reverse, two of cups. Someone's messaging someone. Someone who's not in the house. Or that someone's not in the house. Two of cups, there's a romance here or relationship. Soulmate connection. Someone's sending someone messages from a house or about a house. Someone's not listening to their intuition. Someone is not listening to their intuition. Message messages in the near future. Two of cups. I have to use another deck. But it does have something to do with someone not being generous with someone, someone not giving something to someone. There could be a child involved where there's a problem. There's some sort of extreme information connected to this. It has to do with someone trying to say you don't belong. Someone was lacking in vision here. Or someone feels like someone lacks in vision for talking about you this way. Um, Ten of Swords. Reverse. You've overcome some type of terrible betrayal, setup, backstabbing. You have a gift. You're gifted. There's a blessing here. Um, it's whatever this birth is. This gift, you're birthing something, you are the empress, you could be pregnant. Um, this could have to do with a new beginning, this could have to do with... Your repu reputation, um, something being cleared up about your reputation, this could be a new start, this could be people seeing you as pure hearted. It's like someone was trying to distract someone with lustful energy and it didn't work. Someone's losing their power over someone in a negotiation. They, they were trying to dominate someone. Someone defended themselves because someone's mask is off. It's like these people are losing power. They can't manipulate situations. They can't use... They can't sell people a dream because people know what they did. People know who they truly are. People feel like following whoever this is is going to lead to a dead end. And people know you overcame something here. I feel like they're, they've been trying to manipulate a masculine energy. Stop them from coming towards you. They've been talking about you horribly. Um, but the thing is now people know what they did. So it just looks worse when they talk about you. There's a Queen of Swords here, courtship. Maybe someone really likes your intelligence, they really like your healthy boundaries, they like how gracefully you've handled something. Um, there could also be another feminine energy here doing something to help you on your behalf. This could be like a high level assistant that someone has to talk to now. Um, or. Or there's something about you and the way you, you, you speak. Um, your, your stance, your, your words, your thoughts, how you think. It, but it's how people see you or how someone sees you. They're coming towards you. Generosity. Someone won't be generous with someone. Um, someone is trying to distract someone. And someone won't be generous with them. It's about romance in the environment. It's something about someone not belonging, trying to say someone doesn't belong, say you don't belong. It's some sort of negotiation. Someone's trying to negotiate here. Someone's rebelling though. Someone can't assert themselves because their mask is off. Not sure how all this ties in together. Messages about a two of cup, a two of cups, people being demasked, secrets being unveiled, people knowing what you went through. There's something about 
someone trying to distract someone in the environment, but you're also very clear, <clears throat> or someone's very clear about you, there's some sort of courtship going on. Maybe someone's trying to distract someone from a courtship going on in your life. Knight of Wands, someone's worried that someone's going to passionately come towards you. That's what they're thinking. So that's why they're trying to distract whoever this is. Um, they're trying to dominate this person. Um, but the problem is, is that they can no longer be duplicitous because they're unmasked. They're losing their power. Yeah, and they don't have money to offer. Uh, they could have lost their inheritance. Um, and there's something about a romance here that's a big deal. A really big deal. A lie. Someone was lying. Um, and now, because of it, they're losing their authority. Someone wants their independence, or you're very independent. Someone's not interested in a drama. Outcome, Seven of Swords. Someone is doing something sneaky online, or something that someone did in the past. There's something coming up about hiding, stealing, cheating, thievery, defense. It's the way someone is defending themselves. Impulsive. Yeah, someone's... Someone could be trying to pull someone away with lustful energy in the environment. They're hoping that someone will be impulsive. So there's someone's doing something unjust. They're trying to dominate someone with passion or lust. But they've been demasked. Or they're afraid that someone's coming towards you. And they're trying to dominate them. They weren't expecting something here, so they could be trying to act quickly. Someone's trying to play mind games. A karmic feminine is trying to play mind games? Okay. I thought it was this other masculine. They got knocked off their high horse. But they're still trying to do something here. Someone's trying to play mind games, but they got knocked off their high horse. They're a thief, they weren't able to steal something. Or someone's not interested in them, they see them as a thief. They could be, they could have done something in regards to a child. Um, it's not good. It's about family standards, family, getting a family involved. It's definitely a karmic feminine. on the verge of a nervous breakdown. They're trying to avoid by... They got served karma. They're on the verge of a nervous breakdown. There's some sort of secrets here. Um, something to do with a family. Somebody is denying someone. Someone is not interested in this person. Um, someone might see them as... A, a narcissist, someone doesn't want to claim this person in public. They're getting, they're getting knocked down. This is an ego death. Their journey is over. Someone sees you as the Empress energy. So they're going through an ego death. Someone's interested in you, or because of the way people see you. There's something about a secret relationship here and someone lying about a relationship. Secrets are coming out about it. I feel like this entitled person is playing mind games because they're jealous. Those are the secrets. They're like a sweet talker. This could be a karmic family member involved. And, and the spiritual thief, this karmic feminine. There could be two feminine energies. Someone just not interested in this person. 
don't know if there was like an affair going on. Some sort of... This is, this is... Slightly different here. Okay, so Ten of Wands reverse. Child, child reverse. False spiritual person. Someone... Could be really burdened by something that someone did spiritually. Someone... The child could be something that belongs to you. They have to let it go. The child could represent something you've conceived of that's not theirs. Yeah, a karmic feminine energy. They've been content with this, however this has been. And they're on the verge of a nervous breakdown. Someone is... Replacing them or hooking up with other people. If someone's not bitter, they're moving on. This could be this King of Wands reverse. This could be someone that. This could be not even someone that you um, were in a relationship with. So I'm not sure exactly what this is. They could have been having an affair with someone. So this person could have been in a relationship with this masculine energy from your past and they're having, they were having an affair or trying to get this wealthy man, maybe it's the wealthy man, to connect with them, trying to control a situation, but they've been exposed, secrets are out about how they've acted and someone doesn't want to have anything to do with them what they've done what they did to you something came out um they're being seen as a sweet talker there's something about a family um someone wasted time with this person S something about family a family st They're like a spiritual stalker. It's how someone sees them. They're they're a leech. That's how someone sees them. Someone's in despair. Something's about to be unveiled. Karmic lover reverse. Someone could be trying to hook up with someone. Uh to take something from them. To take a connection away from two people. To get money from them. Um, a masculine energy who seems to be working on themselves. They, they're in denial about some. They feel like they can still squeeze themselves into a situation. They're trying to provoke this person um, in regards to some sort of secrets. This karmic feminine is. There's some. Someone is not listening to their intuition in the near future. They're getting a message. Someone's not in the house. There's something about a two of cups here. Um, two people are together. There's a couple. Um, someone's miserable. Someone's miserable. Someone's being replaced. Someone is hooking up with other people. Um, it's not. It's not cheating if they're not together. Um, but someone was content with the setup the way that it was. Um, there's something about someone not being someone's mistress. Um, yeah, someone does not want to claim this person in public. 
Someone's not listening to their intuition. Someone's getting a message. Someone's not in the house. Someone is hooking up with other people. There's some type of a partnership or a relationship here. Someone wasn't listening to their intuition. But someone's trying to act impulsively. They're trying to work quick here because they weren't expecting this. Um, someone's overcoming a betrayal, maybe in regards to a child, or you're overcoming a betrayal, um, something that you've conceived of or you're having this new beginning. Um, everything they did was a waste of time. They put all this time and energy into something. There's, there's something about family standards here. Someone wants to annihilate someone. There's someone here. It's like they can't get information that they want to get. They're trying not to have a nervous breakdown. About also people, this friendship group gossiping about them. Other people know that someone is not consistent with them. Someone doesn't care who they step on. This spiritual thief is, is a thief. That's how someone looks at them. They see them as a poser and a stalker. Wow. And a gold digger. Wow. And a narcissist. So this person is... Someone is moving forward. Someone's moving forward. There's something about family here as well. Someone could have had a family with this person. Um, there could be a family that's arguing over something, or someone's avoiding a family. Someone could be exiting a situation in a way that's very unclear. No, there's no closure here. Uh, could be. Or they, they said what they needed to say, but it's like someone here still feels like they can keep something going, but I don't know that this is an ex of yours that is this person, um, that this person is pursuing. That's the, the strange part. And there's a big ego death because you're in the picture here. Or because someone sees you as an empress energy. So something happened here where this person was demasked. People kn know that this person was doing horrible things in regards to you. And they're going through some type of ego death because of it. They're being dis like. They're being broken up with, or someone isn't interested in them, but it doesn't feel like a divorce. It feels like something else is going on. Um, there, it seems like there's someone, this is someone else. People know that this person was jealous of you. All these secrets are coming out. Uh, and whoever this masculine energy is, is leaving them high and dry. They're not giving them answers. Um, someone also, I don't know if this person, if they were paying their bills somehow. There's something about this female detective reverse in the environment. And we have this queen of swords and concentration. It's like someone's not getting the information Someone's trying to distract someone. Someone's, someone's real inconsistent with someone 
and someone is trying to get information, they can't get it. They can't get the information they need. And there's something about a courtship in the environment, someone um, pursuing someone. Someone can't be... Okay, there's something about someone you, trying to use a friend here to find something out. Yeah, but they're not getting this information. Or they're trying to use a friend to get information from somebody in the environment. They got served karma. They're being seen as a poser and a narcissist and a spiritual thief. So this is the karma. It has to do with some sort of secrets and some someone being very disinterested in them and people finding out. Um, Knight of Wands thoughts. Someone wants to maybe dominate someone with passion or they're afraid, they're trying to dominate someone before they follow their passion. Um, they're doing something malicious. They want someone to be wishy-washy. They're a leech. There's a bunch of mean girls involved um, that have money issues. They're very hypocritical. There's something about a family here as well. Someone's definitely narcissistic. Outcome, Seven of Swords, someone's trying to steal something online, someone has to defend themselves, or someone is sneaking, or there's lies here. Someone is trying to hide a nervous breakdown. Someone is wasting their time. Um, they're looking for handouts. There's a karmic family member involved. Someone's not easily triggered. Content. Someone wants something to stay the same. I feel like they want someone to act impulsively. So we need to find out... The who's, why's, what's, where's... All someone can think about is getting out of a trap. Someone could be trying to buy their way out of a trap. Or they're dealing with a business person who doesn't want to be trapped. But someone doesn't want something to be over with this business person. Someone is not someone's friend. Someone is not someone's ally. They can't, they can't get something from this person. Someone, someone's a liar. Someone is concealing something. Someone is someone's enemy. They're your enemy. This is like someone in competition with you. With love, they're competing with love and someone's faithfulness. They're not someone's friend. This is not a surprise. But you, you don't seem to be depressed. That someone's, you're not with someone. There's some sort of a letter or communication about a masculine energy who's not doing well and a problem with a child. Something was superficial. It's, none of this is a surprise. 
Someone is false, or someone was false. This wife was false. You, it's not a surprise at all. To you, it's not a surprise. Someone was only faithful because they were being given gifts. They were very false. This is like a gold digger. Who was in competition with you. So you could be dealing with some masculine energy here who has a lot of money. That loved you, but there's like a gold digger that was in competition with you and wants this person's money. But they're jealous of you and things they were doing is coming out. Someone's very inconsistent with someone. Um, every, someone was doing something just out of jealousy. They're jealous of you. Secrets are coming out. And they're demasked. That this is an ego death. They were trying to bully you. There's something about a message connected to this. Having to do with someone's faithfulness. Someone could have made up a lie. Um within a party scene or at a celebration now someone's in despair because they were part of it now someone's not someone's friend and they don't get the money they can't have the money and there's a problem with the child that could be someone else that's part of this someone that aligned themselves with this person that's in competition with you um Deep down, there's a problem with this child. There's a lot of shame here. Some Someone is false. False, false spiritual person, false person. Um, prison. Some, someone feels trapped by this situation. Deep down, someone knows that someone feels trapped. Someone is not someone's lover. They feel trapped. There could be a family member involved, a mat matriarch. It had to do with someone not coming towards you. This whole thing is a mess. Someone's in sorrow over this. Sorrow over faithfulness. There's a masculine energy in the past. Someone wasn't exercising caution. Someone's overcome some type of heartache. Um, or someone's d deeply hurt. They have no hope in regards to this child. It, someone was not cautious. Someone is not helping someone. Someone can't steal something from someone. And they're in sorrow. Someone doesn't want to take a loss with them. Someone doesn't want to be married. Someone, someone loves someone. So I don't know, I feel like someone might have, this could be someone who's like a perpetual cheater. Unless it's, this, if this is an ex that they're trying to manipulate, I feel like this person let them go. I feel like there's an ex that let this person go. And there's someone else here. And I think there's also someone else. There's like a, I feel like this person could have had, they did something, they weren't exercising caution in regards to a child, and now they're feeling hopeless. This could be a masculine energy that wasn't exercising caution in regards to a child, and they feel trapped because now they have a child with this person, or there's a feminine energy that did something extramarital and there's a child that doesn't belong to this masculine and now they know and it's over and this other masculine the king of wands reverse is who they had the child with but they're also hooking up with someone here that has a lot of money and I feel like they thought they were going to be able to formalize this relationship but this person's turning them down. They see you as an empress energy. 
And there's a group of people here too that are celebrating this. They think something is great. They're happy to see this person go down. There's a group here that are happy to see this because this person did something to another feminine energy. And there's like a mother figure involved as well. Or oh, this could be family fighting. I don't know who this, there was something concealed. Someone was keeping a relationship secret and now it's over and people are really happy about it. Someone is not someone's friend, and it, but this is not a surprise and someone's in despair over this. Someone's in despair that something's also going to become known. Uh, that someone doesn't want to be with someone and someone is not going to take care of them or give them anything. Marriage reverse. Someone is not interested in marrying this person. Maybe there was a secret relationship and someone got pregnant and this person won't marry them. So this person, the other scenario is this person could have been with an ex of yours and had some type of an affair and there's a child but whoever this is is not interested in marrying them and there's like another masculine energy too that's involved there's like factions here and people are people will not help someone won't help someone that could be who this female detective in the reverse is. Isn't looking into something for someone. Because they feel like they want to see where this person's going. Who they're seeing. I feel like there is someone here that would continue to use this person. But they're not going to make it public. And... So they, this person could have been married and having some type of affair with someone here. Uh, they weren't expecting this. Someone's not giving them a commitment, a public commitment. And there's also a divorce and someone won't marry someone, but there could be a child. But there's something wrong. There's a problem with the child on top of it. There's something wrong with the child. In the near future here, someone is miserable. They weren't listening to their intuition. Someone's getting some type of a message that someone's not in the house. And there's a two of cups situation. Um, someone's miserable that someone's not at home. Wife reverse. This wife reverse is miserable. They're not able to steal something from someone. There's a two of cups here. Someone's not coming to see them. Or they can't go to see someone. They're not in the house. They're not alone. They're not alone. Someone's not alone. You, you're in the picture here. There's a two of cups. This is a mess. Um, Ten of Swords. Someone wasted their time in this situation. That's how someone looks at this person. Um, and someone overcame a betrayal. They're overcoming or they overcame a betrayal. This person is a waste of time. There's a whole bunch of people that are involved here in this situation. A lot of people. Uh, you're not taking a loss, and it looks like there's someone coming towards you, or you're. This is a past life connection, or you overcame some type of a betrayal, or someone from your past wants to come towards you. Yeah, this is definitely about you. 
Someone was trying to say you're not a sweetheart. Now someone's not someone's friend. I don't know who this other person is. They, they could be part of a party scene or someone's in sorrow about what they did in this group. Now they're they're not your friend or it's about loyalty and friendships here. There's like factions that are splitting. Loyalties are splitting. Everybody knows what someone tried to do to you out of jealousy. This person, there's karma playing out. Uh, this feels humiliating to this person. And there's something about someone coming towards you or a two of cups or love or someone loving you. And this um, wife reverse, they feel... Uh, they're not either they're not interested in this person they could be getting messages from them and this person could be seeing that you're not home and they weren't listening to their intuition and they're feeling miserable or this wife reverse is feeling miserable because the person that they're trying to keep stuck is dating and it seems like potentially you yeah, they can't come towards this person. They're not their friend. Or their friend is not helping. They're in sorrow in the near future. There's miserable. Someone's really upset. And there could be a lot of money at stake as well. There could be like a gathering, a celebration, a party. Um, someone's not sad or depressed. Someone is in a relationship or heading towards a relationship. Um, there's some sort of courtship going on here. Someone isn't able to use their friend to distract someone in the environment or to get information um, because someone's faithful to someone else. Someone's not interested in Super, some sort of superficial thing or someone's faithful to you there's some sort of courtship here maybe someone is trying to look into something they're seeing there's a courtship here someone's faithful to you you have very healthy boundaries so this person is not superficial but there are people who are happy you're not alone uh, there's something about this young woman reverse who didn't get the money uh, and they're not getting any help and they're part of some type of a party scene they're going through a big misfortune so that's another person that's involved wow this is a lot um, Knight of Wands someone's doing something malicious they're hoping that they can dominate someone Maybe get them to move uh, lustfully. This person's very arrogant. Uh, they could be acting like an expert about not coming to see you. Something about a letter, trying to create an ending with some sort of communication. Uh, they're, they're a foe trying to stop someone from coming towards you with some type of communication. Outcome, Seven of Swords. Some sort of lie, lie online. Or they, someone has to defend themselves. Someone is not easily triggered, though. What's going on with the Seven of Swords? What's hidden? What's the lying, cheating, stealing? It has to do with this message. Love is in the upright under the deck. Something about love here. Someone trying to make an impulsive move. Or someone trying to get someone to do something impulsively. Okay, last pass. Someone's trying to play mind games here. It's a karmic feminine. They're, they're dealing with karma. Something is um, embarrassing. They're not getting their way. They're trying to manipulate a situation. 
that it's a bully and the collaboration is falling apart. But they are trying to get people involved, but it's not working. A bully, you're not lonely. They wanted you in a disaster. It didn't work. There's something about a fantasy that's not true. It's all manipulation. They were trying to manipulate someone with these people. But they're getting going through a, some sort of ego death. And death has to do with a family. Some sort of conflict playing out. Someone has evidence of something that someone was doing. Um... It has to do with the whole family. Someone's whole family was involved. Someone has evidence of this. These secrets are coming out. Um, someone's jealous of you. Someone... Wanted someone to be... To not see something. Um... Someone won't stop. Someone wants someone to be blind to something. It's a collaboration. Someone wants someone to be blind to something. This is all about manipulation. They're trying to manipulate something in regards to you. Um, someone didn't exercise caution in regards to a masculine from the past. It created a big problem. It's heartbreaking. Someone's hopeless. It has to do with a child. Someone was not cautious in their recent past. There's a masculine from your past that you were probably in a relationship with. Someone won't help this person because of what they did. This whole family. Yeah. Whatever they did here. This could involve lower vibrational spiritual practices. Um, it didn't bring about any luck and there's a problem with a child. Yeah. Someone won't, I feel like there's a masculine energy that won't help this person. And they're feeling hopeless. So we just have to find out they're going through some sort of ego death here. They can't sell someone a dream. Someone's not interested. The secrets are out. They were not cautious. Someone's interested in someone's money. They're very angry. They just want their money. They're, they're getting angry because someone won't give them money or they won't help them. And they see you as winning and they can't relax. They're overloaded. Uh, someone doesn't want them anymore. They don't want to be married or they won't marry them. There's an illusion that's breaking. They feel like everyone's going to be laughing or everyone's going to know uh, about a divorce or that they got left out in the cold. Um, someone is not helping them. Um, they don't have good ideas. They don't. Someone's not inspired by this person. Uh, Yeah, it's someone's dumping, dumping them. They're like a third party that someone's not interested in. Near future, someone's miserable. Someone's not in the house. Uh, they don't know. Someone's not listening to their intuition. They're miserable. There's a message. There's a two two people are together, but someone someone's not alone. Someone's miserable. Yeah, someone's not alone. Someone's real angry and miserable because someone's not alone. There's a two of cups in the near future. The sweetheart is not alone. Someone's angry because you're not alone. <sighs> they didn't gain anything from any of this. So now they're feeling rejected and you're with someone. 
I feel like that's what that dynamic is. Um, there could be people who don't want to participate anymore. Something's not over for you. You could be saving money. Um, and this person can't relax. Karma's playing out. I feel like karma's playing out in every way in this person's life. I feel like this is just the beginning of it, though. It's a lot of rejection and getting exposed. And there's like people who won't don't want to be their friend. There's something about someone coming towards you here. You, you have a gift. Uh, is there something about someone losing a friendship that someone's not someone's friend that keeps coming up? Someone sees someone as a, a waste of time. Karma's playing out in regards to you. There's evidence of something that someone tried to do to your prof profession. There's something about a family and a lot of anger playing out over your gift. The fact that you have a gift, that you're gifted, and that you have money, that you're smart, that you're intuitive. You could read cards as well don't have to. It's an ego death here. It's something having to do with some type of lower vibrational spiritual energy. Yeah, there's a huge ego death here for a group of people. Something was not merit making for these people. They all got involved. Something's humiliating here. Something that originates with you is yours. It's your gift. They didn't get lucky off of your what's yours. A lot of people are quitting. There's someone faithful or yeah, faithful to you in the environment. You have strong, healthy boundaries. You're very graceful, perceptive. You can't be distracted, or if they're trying to distract someone else, it's not working. Someone's committed. Someone's loyal. Um, this is not good news for them. Um, makes them worried. They feel. Like they're in trouble or trouble's coming their way. They shouldn't have listened to this person. Uh, this is not a fun adventure. You're in the upright. You are a sweetheart. And they ruin their life. This person's trying to... I don't know. Something is not merit making. They're trying to do something malicious. They're trying to dominate someone. But there's this, there's no one that wants to participate. Something that's yours is yours. Someone's very arrogant about this. There could be something about religion here as well. Uh, something's a trap. They're trying to trap someone. They're trying to do something maliciously. Maybe involving uh, religion. Some type of situation that is haughty they're hoping to use that to their advantage it has something to do with material things religion it's all about appearances um, I feel like they want you to take a loss or they're worried they're taking a loss it's about someone making you a promise and them not gaining anything out of this in this collaboration. Whatever this manipulation is. You, you were supposed to be left with nothing. That was the goal. This vow. This collaboration. Yeah, some type of manipulation. They're trying to manipulate someone. It has to do with someone's money. I don't know if they're trying to make someone feel unsure. There's something about religion here. Uh, they want someone to hesitate and be worried. Uh, it could have to do with money and religion. Um, 
they're trying to use get someone's in their ego. Um, they want someone to be afraid to make a move. Uh, unrelaxed, not able to go within. And they're trying to distract someone. It, yeah, it has to do with you. You being in the upright here. Um, they're trying to make someone feel like something about money, appearances, and religion. And, and as if there's some sort of something that's still coming um, in regards to some sort of accident. Um, but like a goal that they have, a goal, so they did some sort of ceremony maybe. <sighs> trapped, someone's trapped. Someone's trapped. Someone will be trapped. They're trying to say that they can manipulate someone, trap them um, in fear. Um, or they want to manipulate and trap this masculine energy in fear. Uh, try, try to keep them going. Try to get them in their head and their ego. Um, something like that. So the main thing here is... Um, there's something about a broken promise, someone not being able to relax about a broken promise. Um, they could be trying to get use guilt. Um, Seven of Swords, there's something about a message that's hidden. This could be online. Someone's not easily triggered by this message. It's a lie, someone's cheating, stealing, sneaking here, someone's sneaking, hiding. Something is not over. Something's not over. There's something about a loss. Someone's taking a loss. Someone is... Someone is... Stalking... Someone with this vow. There's overindulgence here. It's a collaboration. They can't relax. Someone is still trying to sneak around. There's something about someone stalking someone here. Someone's taking a loss because something's not over. I just feel like this person's sneaking around. They're, they're doing something with messages. I'm just gonna clarify this outcome. Um, and then we'll call it a read. Yeah, there's family involved that all hate your light. A whole family that hate your light. Someone here has a lot of bad habits. And they're clout hungry. going on in this outcome they're just obsessed with you um outcome seven of swords what's going on here for the collective that's watching this video a thief is fishing for comments they're sneaking around online they're stalking their sneak peek, fishing for comments, sneaking around online, talking shit online. <laughs> um, someone's not extra triggered though. They're trying to. Fishing for comments online. I don't know if someone's trying to trigger you online. That's the best they can do. That's like their last thing they have. Trying to do something on their own 
online watching something to do with a romance. I'm trying to stalk someone online or still figure something out that they can do to block some type of romance or they're overly concerned. They're in a girl fight with you and trying to get some sort of evidence of something. <laughs> still. Um, yeah, this person is not paying attention to their children if they have them. Um, they could be dealing with legal issues. Um, yeah. There's something about them. They're having trouble with money or something like that. They're a spiritual hater. They could be trying to pretend like they're not watching you all the time. Yeah, a wolf in sheep's clothing. They're trying to pretend like, you know, you could be doing very well and they're having family issues or a whole family. They're trying to pretend like they're not curious about you, but they're doing something online or there's something about someone trying to get proof or get evidence of something having to do with who you're connecting with. Um, you're dodging all these bullets, um, of course, this person's exposed, so I think that's why they're trying to hide what they're doing, because they're so obsessed, um, I feel like it's just stalking you online or something, um, trying to get evidence, um, I just feel like you're not, it's not bothering you. Um, yeah, you're this boss, run their own business, stable, busy, multifaceted, um, and you're not in a nightmare, um, and you don't care if your light irritates their demons because you're just focused on whatever you're building, things are positive for you, yeah, they could be doing something online, um, they see you're not haunted. Um, I feel like they're going through some sort of legal issues. They're trying to stop someone from leaving. Um, trying to see if someone, they could be trying to go onto a masculine energy's computer and look at their search history or something like that. Instead of working, they're not working. Whoever this masculine is, is not crying over them. They see them as a drama starter. Um, and somebody who fakes their lifestyle and tries to create scarcity tactics for other people. Um, so we'll leave it there. I feel like that paints somewhat of a clearer picture. Um, yeah, if you resonate, I hope that it helps. I feel like in a few days the stuffy nose will be gone. I can get back to my normal sound. Um, yeah, so if this resonates, I hope that it helps, and I will see you on the next one. Bye.